Yes, boys and girls, and welcome back to another vlog. Now, today, we're going to be going to Wembley for a tournament with the Connected Club Cup. Now, first things first, as we do in these, these vlogs, we're going to rate the skin fade. Now, I did get this about two days ago in time, you know, to go out in town in Mansfield and, uh, you know, look sharp as ever. But, yeah, skin fade rating... I think I'm going for a nine, you know, I, if I could have this trim forever, for every time I go for the trim in the next 10 years, I'd get it. It's bang on. But yeah, I'm I'm in 4K as well, like 1080. I don't know what's going on. I think 60 FPS for this vlog. See what's going to happen. A few clips in the last one were glitched, but if you move it about, it does look cinematic. Anyway, here's the bag, um, you know, full up of stuff that we need. I'm not taking any controllers, which is risky, but I think we should be given, uh, given some when we get there. Um, I'll just quickly show you the email now. So yeah, here's the schedule, entrance to Wembley Stadium, arrival, and here's the big one, exhibition match with England players. Now hopefully we can get some England senior players and some of the rest as well, because you do play two games, so hopefully we can get some of them and a good Instagram post to go with it. But yeah, regarding that, um, I'm excited, I can't wait. The tournament's actually tomorrow, but we just started um, like going today, travelling up to the hotel. But yeah, I'm excited, um, I can't wait. Um, last thing, I'm not too bothered if we win, but we're going for the win anyway. The winner does get like a signed Xbox and stuff, but yeah, it's a very long intro, so we're just going to cut to the chase. You'll see some train action in approximately 30 minutes. See you then. Yes, ladies and gents, as you can see, we're at the local train station, Woodhouse. I need to go and collect my tickets now. But yeah, I just want to mention, um, the support on the last vlog was amazing. Um, obviously not as many views as not as normal like a tactics video, but that's just standard. The amount of messages I received was amazing. So yeah, that's why I'm doing another one. We're going to Wembley today. Come on! But yeah, like I said, I'm not too bothered about winning the tournament. Don't tell them I said that. I'm just here, experienced, England players, gang. I'm going to get my tickets now, and then I'll do some cinematic on the train, because I'm a top vlogger. Top striker, call me Thierry. Bang, bang. Chaps, just got out of the shower. You know me, sinking a Red Bull. Um, I don't know. Worst sleep of my life. Oops, there's a spoon there. Worst sleep of my life, to be honest. Like, uh, I went to sleep. Uh, well, couldn't sleep, looked at my phone, it was one. Kept trying to go to sleep, looked at my phone again, it's five. No, no, seven, seven, seven. And then I went to sleep. I set the view. I went to sleep, and like, low key, Went sleep for an hour. <coughs> but there's some cool stuff on the Wembley design today regarding me. So I can show you that in a minute. I just want to quickly explain that I qualified for the stage on an online phase. I only had to win like two games. I just wanted the England sign show, which I've got at home. I'll show you when I get home, if I remember. And then there was a, a thing in Staffordshire, Chase Town, and I won that. And then I'm here. So basically, come through two things. The sign next what's on the line. Like I said, a few England players there. Deck Rice, Gerald Bowen and Ramsdale. Get me a picture with the Irons boys. But yeah, apart from that, I'm just getting ready to go and I'll do some stuff outside. See you then. Yes, ladies and gents, I see some competitors in the back. And up there, we have the Wembley Stadium. There's me, uh, that side. But yeah, um, basically, I didn't really say how I qualified for this. There was like a first bit, which I won two events. Um, I won two games, one at England sign shirt, which I'll show if I remember. But if not, then yeah. Then there was a next event in Staffordshire at Chase Town, which we won again. But yeah, some competitors in the back. Wembley Stadium. You know how it is. Game day in the FA Club box. Hopefully we can get the win. Let's go. Ladies and gentlemen, I've got a confession. I didn't vlog at all today, but guess what? We're the champ. I'm gonna get Colston later to show my shirt. It's actually really, really good shirt, really cool. But yeah, we've got a trophy as well. I'll show you some photos of that. But yeah, I'll just talk over it as well when I get home and basically speak through the day. Also, bing bong, you know, I can actually get clips off the Twitch feed. Yeah, true, very true. Vlog is fantastic. Moving on. Yes, guys, and welcome back to my YouTube. Now, obviously, I've done the intro and stuff um, leading up to the Wembley um, Connected Club Cup by EE. Um, and yeah, basically, I've already done a few clips. However... I didn't vlog at all on the day, at all. I didn't do any clips, apart from bef before and after the tournament. Um, but luckily, there's a Twitch stream with the whole day's action, seven hours worth. So we're going to go through it with me talking over it. 
Um, but yeah, this is just me on the face cam. I'm going to put myself as a smaller bit in the top right corner there. But let's get straight into it. I hope you guys enjoy. Right, so here we go. Um, this is just Rachel and Ryan going through it. Players right now. Meeting the players. Is Redlack. You might actually recognise this particular FIFA player because he's actually been on the scene for a while. He's still grassroots, but you can see there he's qualified for two E Premier League Grand Finals. Only 19 years of age though, but is fifth ranked in the UK. Yep, he's a fantastic player, but on to player number two. So yeah, two. that's pretty much it. There was me. That's Ben coming up. We do have um, all six of us did get like a player profile in, and that's that. Um, but yeah, so we're pretty much just going to skip through this. Let me show you all the players quickly. So we got Ben. He's 20 years old. It's his first uh, FIFA tournament, and you can see on. his favourite formation again. He's got Colston. If you are familiar with the FIFA scene, pro player for Burnley. Still age 20. Longest competitor in the Harvey. His favourite formation is only 16 years old. Someone to sign. <coughs> L down in 17. Low Griffey 25. Now, that's all the competitors. Um, let's just get straight into the gameplay. I'm gonna show you all my gate. Wait, can I show you all the games? No, I think I can only show you Colston and yeah. Either way, let's just get straight into it. He'll be kind of scratching his head. What what went wrong in the second leg there, Ryan? Yeah, gut wrenching. I think he'll be devastated to give up a four goal lead. But for Red Light, what a comeback! I'll be honest, I thought it was game over, but unbelievable comeback. Should talk about low Griffey first then. Two, two nil up, then in that yeah, guys, so obviously um, I've got an interview coming up in on the highlights, so I'll just show that. There? Probably put this in the what video rather than what I just you know recorded because obviously the final is a bit of a key. So, a little bit of context I was on six, low Griffey was on nine, Colson was on four, Harvey was on three, Ben was on three. So, basically, long story short, if I get a draw, it actually kept it in my hands. If I lose, it's not in my hands. If I win, I'm pretty much through. <coughs> So yeah, let's just go straight into the highlights with Ryan and Rachel. How many goals are you going to end up scoring? But to concede the first and the second and maybe not look to keep possession might be an oversight on his part. But again, you have to look on Redlack, attacked fantastically well. And in a way, for Lord Griffey, it's kind of lucky that he escapes with a point. I don't know it's coming off, off the back of that second leg. So yeah, it's tough. A point is vital there. He's still sitting top of the pile with 10 points now with one more round of these round robin fixtures to go. But let's have a look then at the highlights from that round four fixture between we go. Low Griffey and Redlack there. So we said he went 2 0 up, didn't he, with the first leg? This is the first goal then, Ryan. Yeah, this is a, a goal from Low Griffey to give him the one goal lead in this leg of FIFA. But it was a breakthrough here. I should have finessed that, I think. It was a chip of the goalkeeper. Like it didn't end up going in. It was a great clearance just before it passed the line. But these are good highlights. I like this. As he builds up here on the 30th minute. Great build up towards the byline with Ronaldinho. Biding his time, waiting for the extra pass inwards. I tried to head to the keeper, but I've done an offside trap. So then I got rigged. It's my fault. The keeper was intercepted and it was low Griffey to go two goals up. But it was a quick response here from Red Lack. Open space in the middle of the field here, and a reverse elastical with Ginola, fantastic finish. Into yeah, so that's four nil down. To give him a now it's four one, and it was almost instantly here. Penalty ref. given away here, ten minutes before half. -time. Like I say, guys, make sure to remember to this penalty here. This one, remember, I went left, aggregate. he stood middle. Now, people who don't play FIFA won't know like mentally, but how much goes into penalties, right? That is important. Just remember that for the final. I went left. He stood. I went in the corner left. He stood middle. Okay, yeah, remember. Here we are. Well, let me t wait, wait, wait. let me turn my camera off so you can see properly. Well, I think we should ask him what you just said there. Do you think the game could have been won there? Sixty-seven yeah. minutes on the clock. He got that equaliser. Did you believe you could go on and get the three points to win at that moment? Yeah, of course. Um, based on the swing of it, 4-0 down, back to 4-4, I was really confident. But I just thought, you know, the draw is very important because one game left on seven points, you know, um, it's still in my hands, I think. Correct yeah. me if I'm wrong. But yeah, I'm happy with my performance. Um, it looks like I went 4-0 down and then I, all of a sudden I started playing good in 4-4 four, four and that. There were chances going wide and all sorts, but that, that's FIFA, that's football. So, yeah, I thought I played well and it's one of them. We'll go into the next game with confidence. Yeah, Low Griffey's coach said that, didn't he, Rye, to yeah. us. He said you had two big misses in that first leg, which possibly should have gone in. But um, I, didn't, I didn't right. push on from there. The finals kicked yeah, off. It was, it was a really disappointing season from my, my I can see straight away. Just, I'm just going to spoil it. Yeah, I've, always, I've always said that. But Let's just see it. Listen, I never learn. I never learn. Did he just celebrate? 
<laughs> Look at this, by the way. It's just the goals he scores. They're so like just chips. They're all like chips. No, he didn't celebrate. He didn't celebrate. I'll be real. I need to learn, right? I always go two down, then come flying back. If I just <laughs> if I just hold the ball right for the first half, then start flying, I'll win four 0 not four two. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> As an example. Yeah, I didn't have my tactics set up. Right. Let's look. What happened? I was playing. I go two 0 down. Like it's not looking good, bruv. Yeah. Another chip into nowhere. Look at me. I'm I'm sleep, bro. Very very nice. I'm sleep. Look at me. I'm dying over it. Sometimes right, here we are, my attack now. Good pass. That is lucky for me, but then, oh, 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 okay, okay. I got lucky. It went through his legs, but then I dribble past his keeper because I'm smart. Right. Oh my god, we're in. No, no, no. Right, straight off the kickoff, by the way. Genuinely, five seconds after I've just scored. Killed him with the roulette. Pele. Oh, 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 oh! <coughs> Look at me, oh! Oh! <laughs> That's a joke. Man, see that left stick dribbling there? Crazy. Okay. Sit down. LB stop. Green. What a player, man. What a player. Oh, yeah. By the way. By the way. We weren't allowed to wear headsets on Xbox, okay? We weren't allowed to wear headsets on Xbox. There's people having a normal conversation about random stuff 10 yards to my left. Bro? I'm fuming. But anyway. I'll be real. That's it, though, for this half. Uh, this leg. After our first game has concluded, Redlack uh, seems to be the better player. I think after the two goals that he conceded, I don't know what switched, but obviously something did switch and he just played a lot better. Um, honestly, I said it about um, Low Griffey, he could have been three in a look. I think Redlack could have been three goals ahead. The amount of chances he had, that extra passage got intercepted. It was mm. a fine, fine margin. I'm with you. Maybe. But look, very, very there's me. I look sick on that. Alright, either way, we just restarted. That's him, because I'm not using Cantona. Good attack from him. Good attack from him. Right, here we are, we've got an attack. Good ball inside. Ooh. That's so lucky. Look at me. Do you know the thing there, right? What I was doing in every other scenario was trying to pass it one more. So with that one, when I just done the feature, when I had a shot on, it was really good because I hadn't been doing that and I was trying to pass it and get intercepted. But yeah, obviously it bounced fortunately back to me. Watch this chance. Watch this chance. I'm trolling. Ref. Ref. Look at me, ref. Alright, look at this, look at this, look at this. So this is where he's going constantly. You can see his players are flying forward. I've got no options. I can't pass to anyone at this point, so I hit it long. Little flick. Me. Nah, look at this. Good runs from the boys. He really could be out the game now. Did it into down ball roll around the goalkeeper squeezes it in. And it's a three goal cushion for Redlack. Which slowly but surely is Zidane. cruising his way Come to on, victory man. here. I wish I celebrated more just to like troll, and but like it's not like it meant so so much to me, do you know what I mean? So I didn't do it passionately, but I wish I liked winked and stuff just to troll. Yeah, look, he got a goal back. But I've got no options on constant press, so. I was trying. To give him an easy help again now. Pele, literally dancing Ooh. in the box. Finds on its feet again. That time, he'll find the on his own. 
clever pass to try and find the one more. Still could very oh, well what? Oh, oh, oh. Penalty. Oh, it's a penalty. I got lucky to win the ball back though. Oh my god, watch this. This is what I said. Remember, I went left, he stood middle. Oh no, he hasn't. Oh no, he hasn't. No, that's why I said it. First time we played, I went left in the corner. That's important because if he dives left, it won't save it because it's in the corner. And we've got the target, so you can, I can see where if it's going to be in the corner or wide or anything. Whereas in competitive, you can't see where it is. So basically, he knows I can put it in the corner. So he's stepped and dived. And I've just dinked it, mate. That's just special. Just a little penanka, mate. Took the piss. At this point, I knew it's game over. I'm what? Three goals up. 79. Oh. Ah. That's football. That's game over. Game set match. As we said, alongside match tickets to England, Germany, a signed men's shirt from the Euros this year, a subscription to E45. What he will get is a trophy for this year's tournament. The Xbox Series X, which is signed alongside that of the controller too. As you rightly said, Richard, two tickets. To a yeah, that's the prizes I won, by the way, guys. So, like, what? I got a signed Xbox and controller and stuff with signed by Mount Bellingham Rice. Like, oh, my God. In fact, I've had a really, really solid performance as his uh, assistant manager. He have been telling him all the way throughout the tournament. Dard. I think I started trolling. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Here we go. Champion powered by e. Champ. Let's go, champ. Look at me, man. Yeah. Either. Nah. Well played to Lou Griffey though, man. He played well. But look at me. Hoskin feed. Nick the water. Zahinio. Pro player. Coaching him. Kalade, my guy. Colston in the back. Look at Kalade. Sahib. First ever. Offline tournament yeah. for a player that we've seen a lot Come on, man. Let's go. What time and where he's been online. Now he's had his first taste of being at an offline event. Expect to see that man. It was a great day, thanks to EE for everything. Sorting the travel, the accommodation near Wembley, and the big day at Wembley in the club box. Thank you very much. Right, I've got an interview coming up. Great. Right, if I say green, by the way, there's people that are like, I'm friends with in real life that will watch this. Green means, I just say it when I score, but it's when you green time a shot. So on FIFA, if you shoot, and then you shoot as you're about to hit the ball again, it does it green, it does it like more powerful, more accurate sort of thing. Great run, by the way, from Zola. One more. Woo. That's the thing about FIFA 22, the one more is so important. I'm going to turn my camera off, you can watch the interview. Well, Redlap, congratulations. That was an epic final. You are our champion. You are our connected club cup, powered by EE Full Fibre champion for 2022. That's quite a mouthful, but how does that sound? Yeah, no, it sounds great. Um, I thought, like you said, I peaked later on and um, I played amazing in the final. I thought I dominated. So, yeah, really happy to win. I mean, you were smiling all underneath those highlights there at what you just achieved in that grand final against Low Griffey. Just sum up the final as well. Going two goals down early on, was it always in your mind that you could bounce back like you did? Yeah, yeah. Um, a lot of my friends will know I always go 2 0 down and I just fly back. So, yeah, I done well to get straight back into the game and then. From there, I felt like, like I said, I dominated every time the ball was loose. I won it back. I kept possession, and yeah, some some of the goals I scored, by the way. No, that's some, like some nice goals, some great goals. Of course, we know how it is competing in FIFA. Of course, the mental side of it is very important. So you've already played Lord Griffey coming back from four goals down. You think that gave you the edge going into this game? Um, yeah, I felt like I knew that when I went two 0 down, he knows that I can come back again. Yeah. But also, like if I take the lead. He, he doesn't know if he can come back. So I felt like that, you know, was in my advantage and I used it well. I mean, you ended your FIFA season after the playoffs a little bit earlier on. You kind of put a tweet out saying FIFA 22 kind of finished it there. You've had a chance to come back and play again after possibly not playing so much recently. What does it mean to actually completely end your season now with a massive win? 
yeah, no, it's great. Um, like I said, I can't wait to get into next season. But for now, like, this trophy is amazing and I can't wait to put it on my windowsill. So, yeah, I'm really happy with it. Right, guys, here we are. I'm just going to filter through some pictures from the day, um, some of the moments caught on camera. So, yeah, here's me, the champion, shown on E's Twitter. Thank you very much to E for running the tournament. Here's me with the trophy. You can actually see that, like, the engravement there, if I zoom in. Um, but yeah, I'm just waiting for the trophy. Um, I'm getting my name engraved on it. So Also, I couldn't fit it in my bag, so I just left it in London with them. Hopefully, they can send it to me. Here's me. This is the best picture of the day. Obviously, it's a forced reaction because they're like, potential for just one. But like this picture is amazing. I love it. Um, holding the trophy. You can't really see. Oh, you can there a bit. Uh, e FIFA champion. Elbow looks good. Wristbands look good. Hand looks good. Face looks good. Hair looks good. It's bang on. That's the profile picture. All right, next. There's just me again with a trophy at Wembley, as you can see. Me, um, another really good picture. You can actually see it clearly here, E FIFA champion. Um, but yeah, as you can see, I'm very happy. Here's me when I've just been handed the trophy by Ryan and Rachel. Looking funny. Um, here's me when I've just won. But yeah, the fist bump. Um, nah. It was a really good day. This is the one. <laughs> Me, Rice and Bowen. Come on, man. But yeah, nah, it was really nice seeing Rice and Bowen and Ramsdale, especially, um, you know, watching them on TV and stuff. It's really good to see them in real life. Me and Jess Carter, you know, is playing 2v2 against Rice and Downing. Really good game. Um, but yeah, this one is really good as well. I really like this one. Obviously, me in the action in game. Um, but yeah, I like that one. Me and Beth England, as you can see, another one, just playing 2v2 in the expedition. Um, but yeah, it was great fun. Look at these pictures, man, they're so good. Look at this one. Oh my god. Here's me just off guard, and then Ramsdale's chilling. But of course, there could only be one winner, and this is this man here. AC Redlack, he is the Connected Club Cup, powered by EE, full fibre champion for 2022. Guys, thank you so much at home for watching, and to all our six grand finalists as well. And to Richard and Brandon. Ryan Pessoa, and once again, to Redlack. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you very soon. Goodbye.